Hey guys, in this video I'm going to show you how you can use this remote control infrared 12 volt relay. I got this thing off eBay for around $4 and it says it has a range of about 45 feet. So these things always have a little bit of a tricky wiring diagram. They always require an extra input for the power and then they have a separate switch that doesn't put any power out. You need to put 12 volts into these two prongs here and for that I'm going to be using these little connectors. And this is the actual switch. There's a ground, which is the middle one. And then there's normally open and normally closed. So we want the normally open one. So let's screw that in. Now since I want to power something of 12 volts, I'm actually just gonna take the input and connect it to the switch as well so I don't have to have a whole different power source to power what I want to power. So I have this 12 volt connector connects to a little plug and it connects to the wires here. So we're going to connect that up. Now we're going to connect one of the switch leads to the power. So the power will feed this switch. Now the wiring is finished and these will be the outputs here and here. And that's where your load will go. So here we have a 150 watt beam light. This is what we're going to be testing the little relay with. So let's connect it up. Now I don't actually have a power supply free right now that will power this. So the one I'm going to be using will probably just pulse it and turn off. So let's connect it up. And for the remote, it doesn't come with a battery, so you're going to have to put one of those flat cell batteries in it like every other remote. So let's turn it on. Whoa! That is bright. I just got blinded by that. Well yeah, it works. It's pretty cool. Of course it's only like a foot away. Let's go for another blast. Whoa. That is really bright. <laughs> okay, so now we're going to do a range test. This is 10 feet. Works. 20 feet. Works. 30 feet. Oh, that's pretty good. Okay, here's the 45 feet. Forty feet. So it works at around 40 feet, but not 45. Which is still pretty good considering it's using infrared. But just keep in mind that it needs a direct line of sight. So the little LED, which I can't see, but the camera should see, can shine in it. As you can see the little red dot. Well, this is a great option for some small LED lights, or even a big LED light, with a better power supply, of course. But this is a pretty good gadget for four bucks. I'm definitely be using this in the future for some pranks. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe.